She just wants to ruin everything. Oh, wait a minute. Shh. Do you hear something? It's coming from in here. What? Good morning, Pioneers. It's time again for WVKN Live. It gives you the information for the day from the Media Center. Today is Tuesday, October 9th, 2018. I'm Jack Duncan. And I'm Addison Campbell with a look at today's news. But first, let's stand and join Maribel Salazar for the Pledge of Allegiance. Maribel? Good morning, Pioneers. Please stand for the pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Thank you. You may be seated. Now back to our anchors. Well done, Maribel. Now let's join Cassius Robinson, who is in the WPKM Weather Studio, for a check on the weather. Cassius? Good morning, Pioneers. Today's weather will be scattered thunderstorms with a 60% chance of rain. The wind will be blowing out of the east at 13 miles per hour. The humidity will be 72%. The high today will be 90 with a low of 75. Have a great day. Now back to our anchors. Thank you, Cassius, for that informational weather update. For lunch today, our incredible Romeo chefs are preparing for us a choice of chicken drumsticks or a yogurt lunch pack with sweet potato casserole and fresh fruit. Don't forget your choice of milk. Now here is Miss Bayless Hammers White with today's Pioneer Minutes. Good morning, Miss Bayless and Miss White. Good morning, Pioneers. Here we are at Camp Romeo, and we have some special guests today, and we are going to let Ms. Viverito share a little bit of information about Romeo's very own 4-H. Here you go, Ms. Viverito. Okay, uh, thank you, Ms. Bayless. Um, I'm Ms. Averito, and I am one of the co-leaders of our Romeo Roundup 4-H Club. We meet once a month on Thursdays after school, and these students up here are our officers for the year. They were elected by the peers in the club, and I just wanted to um, announce them for you. So our president, um, we have Ashley Estrada. Uh, vice president, we have Jack Duncan. Our secretary is Kate Viverito. Our treasurer is Michael Vasiento, and our reporter and historian is Annette Fuentes. So we're very excited for this year, and just keep an eye on Dojo and all that stuff. We'll be posting pictures um, and share some more happenings with our club. Very good. That is super exciting. You know, these boys and girls represented us well at the so Southeastern Livestock whatever, Southeastern Youth Fair. But not only that, you know, 4-H is more than just one event one week. 4-H goes on all year, and a lot of the things that they do, yes, they do raise bunnies and chickens and cows, but you know what? They also give speeches, and they take pictures. And I know some of them, although I'm not seeing them right now, one of them bakes a mean cake, and <laughs> so there is a lot more to 4-H than just animals and plants. So if you are interested, why don't y'all Google that and see what you can learn in 4-H. Maybe you want to be a member. Wouldn't that be awesome? All right. So congratulations to all of our officers and to our 4-H leaders. Thank you to all of our staff out there who works every week with our 4-H club. All right, boys and girls, y'all can... Go start your awesome day, and it is going to be an awesome day because I got a letter, and this letter filled my bucket. 
So it's from Jason Purcell. Hi, Jason. Thank you for your letter. It says, good morning. I hope you have a good day. And I thank you so much for being the principal. Can you also tell Miss White, Miss Williams, and also the lunch ladies that they are awesome too? You ladies are super awesome. You know, that's like the best thing ever because nobody ever tells me I'm awesome. I'm always running around telling everybody else they're awesome, but I very rarely hear it back. So, Jason, this means a lot. Thank you. And those Matt Manatee letters are due today. What is your favorite type of game? What is it? And why do you like to play it? Don't forget, grandparents are coming today. School pictures also going on. Follow those schedules. Miss White, what you got for us? You can't forget Kona Ice. Kona Ice is here today, too. So we have a lot happening, boys and girls. So be ready. Kona Ice, remember your times. Picture day, remember your times. Grandparents will be coming out at about 10 o'clock. We have some bus stars today to recognize. So congratulations to the following buses. 3005, 3024, 3035, 3037, 3028, 3077, 3039, and 3025. Great job following those expectations, being the leaders on our campus. And I have our attendance happy campers. These are the classrooms that had 95% of their students here last week. And I even have a couple of 100%, so we're gonna have some bubble parties this morning. Well, congratulations to Miss Irizari's class, Miss Cedar, Miss Minotti, Miss Teller, Miss Howell, Miss Noller, Miss Pierce, Miss Velez, Miss Connor, Miss Guest, Miss Mullins, Miss Peterson, Miss Barano, Miss Heidevik, Miss Lamb, and Miss Centron. I gotta say, first grade, second grade, you guys are rocking the attendance. Very excited. And then with 100% attendance. Congratulations. Everyone was here last week, every single day, Miss Curiel's first grade and Miss Kidney's second grade classes. So great job, boys and girls. You've got to be here to learn. We want everyone here every single day. And I know we are missing quite a few people because we think some people are concerned about the weather. Boys and girls, we're doing just fine. That hurricane is way off in the Gulf. It's not coming this way. And if it changes course, we'll let you know. So we're expecting you here every single day. Come on to school. The doors are open. We are learning. Have a wonderful day. We will see you tomorrow. And now back to our anchors. Thank you, Ms. Bayless and Ms. White. Now let's join Valerie Larrabee, who's ready to lead us with our school expectations. Valerie? We will be safe and we will be leaders. Thank you. Now back to our anchors. Well, that's all for today, Pioneers. Thanks for watching WBKN this morning. Be sure to join us again for t tomorrow for the, the news, news that, that kids, kids can, can count, count on, on to start, start their day. day. I'm Jack Duncan. And I'm Madison Campbell. Until next time, see you later. Bye for now.